I'm not Bill Cosby anyway. He coordinates spoon. Ooh, wait a minute. I'm pretty. Oh yeah. Pretty, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> our, first guest, <laughs> our first guest this morning has earned the reputation of America's funniest dad and actor and comedian John Witherspoon is also known for such catchphrases as, you got to coordinate. <laughs> Did I say that right? That's right. <laughs> you got to coordinate. You got to coordinate. Yeah. Yeah. Thank we were, you. We were just giving Godfrey a, a hard time about his pants on the ground. Pants, pants on, I mean, on the ground. On. I know. Right. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, about hanging out, Godfrey. We're just going to say It's it. true. And I knew that John had something to say about that. Well, you got to coordinate. <laughs> <laughs> you coordinate. I coordinate. Oh, yeah. See? Oh, yeah. You got to coordinate. <laughs> yeah, he's at Addison. Addison Improv. Right. Yes, you're so representing I'm Arlington. Too. You're I'm at, at Addison. Addison. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. My, one of my favorite places to work. Does it ever get old to you doing the stand-up shows once you've done television and all that? Well, the, the bottom line is you get cash. <laughs> <laughs> like whatever they pay you for, yeah. It. That makes everything. That makes everything nice. <laughs> like that, look at it. <laughs> That's all you want to see people do. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing gets old. <laughs> do, you, never gets old. do you have people that stand out to you that you've loved working with? When you when you're working on the level like with, with Eddie Murphy and uh, and Richard Pryor, you like them all. You know yeah. the Wayne brothers. I'm on a new TV show called The First Family, and I work with uh, Cleta Smith and uh, Christopher Duncan, and Gladys Knight is my wife. Awesome. Oh, wow. Uh, uh -huh. I play the president of the United States' father. Oh, yeah. Chris, okay. Chris is, the, is, the, is the president. Yeah, he's right? president. Yeah. 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 Okay. And so, uh, they, 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 nice people. The only problem is you got to memorize lines. That's the only problem I'm having. <laughs> Do they, now, I was going to ask you about that. When you're doing a show, are they, are they pretty lax with you as far as letting you um, ad-lib what you want no, to? No, not this show. No. They married to their scripts. Oh, no. <laughs> the writers get mad. They pay as soon a lot as, of money for those scripts. Yes, as <laughs> soon as uh, they say, okay, cut, we're going to shoot it again. Everybody's from the top. The lady come over and say, Miss Witherspoon, you didn't say this. You said oh. this. I said, it mean the same thing? <laughs> <laughs> they, well, get mad, they get mad if you make it funnier, don't they? Some of the writers, because sometimes yeah. I'm sure you see yeah. it and go, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. It's but, so, but they're married to their scripts, and then nothing you can do about it. You just memorize the whole script, and that's, that's it. I think we have a clip of something. What is it, Colleen, that we have a clip of? Hey, let's oh, take a look. Boy. You can tell us what this is. Now, this is ad lib. <laughs> hey, that's a come on out here, I got a message here. That's Friday the next. Come on, man. <laughs> come on out here. Come on, this freaking stuff. <laughs> Mr. Jones, Stanley. <laughs> <laughs> you, have, you have air freshener in your yeah, head. But that's, yet, right? When I work on a movie like that, you add, you can't add it because right. Ice Cube and those guys are real easy with yeah. you. Uh -huh. But TV is totally different. But, you, but I love it when I do movies like that. You know, and I wonder if it's because on television, you know, those writers, that's their that's their job every week, mm -hmm. you know, to come up with these, yeah. these different um, skits and scripts. Well, and, I, you know, they think that they, their stuff is brilliant, but a lot of time it's <laughs> not <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> It is the worst <laughs> sex. It is the worst script I've ever heard and ever, re ever read. And I try to tell him, this is not funny. Yeah. And let, I know funny. And let me make it funny. Oh, no, you must stick to your script. Yeah. Boom. Do they realize you? Because when you do stand up, people don't realize you're a, you're a stand up first. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh, you've been doing stand up for Oh, I've been doing stand up over 30, 35 years. 30? Wow. You hear that, folks? Wow. Oh, yeah. Wow. 35. 35 years. 35. It's a grown man sport. How has, how has your, um, how have your skits changed over the years when you do stand up? Well, you know, you, you know, things come to you and you put it, you put it out there. I mean, if it doesn't work, you put it back in here. <laughs> <laughs> but basically, you know, I'm a character now, so I can basically say anything. Yeah. Because right. it's coming from Pops. You right. Know, so right. it's coming from, now I'm granddad on the, on the TV show, but, um, so, but before you have to be real funny. But before I was, uh, you know, I, when I, see, when I first started working, I used to wear Gucci shoes and a Navy jacket, and I would play police officers and judges, but I couldn't make any money. So I got me some white shoes, a flower mm -hmm. shirt, and a bow tie like you see that 
Uh -huh, in that first uh -huh. clip. And now I'm a millionaire. <laughs> 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 but, in, but in real life, you're a dad, right? You I'm have, a father. You have two you're sons. A father, wonderful. With Gladys, then? No, on, on the show, <laughs> I'm. On the show, I'm. <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to figure it out here. No, no Gladys Knight. Like, like, wouldn't that be a good story? Gladys Knight is. Gladys Knight is not my real wife oh. in, 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 uh, in the reality. Oh. See, now I'm being funny. No, that's very right? good. So the fact dad. that you're blonde <laughs> and you said it. That's <laughs> <laughs> hilarious. Gladys Knight is not. I'm only taking Godfrey because it's funny, and it's National Whiskey Day, so you know. You're Mr. Knight. Everything. And she's my TV wife. I know, I know. I and she know, got I big know. lips, and I suck on them lips every week. <laughs> yeah, I love it, I love it. And I'm getting paid for it. <laughs> You're getting paid for it. But, but in real life, though, truly, you are a dad. You have a 17 year old son? 17 right? and 24. Okay. And, and I just taught my son how to drive, and oh, he's got wow. this car. I gave him a car, and it, it, it's, it's filthy right now already. And I only had it about three weeks, and it's just. Absolutely. Isn't that so frustrating? I, I know. Th that my sons are the same way. You know, they yeah. get these cars, and I'm like, okay, keep it clean, take yeah. care of it. They don't care. And it's like a. Well, you eat, you live in the car. Oh, exactly. The you got your clothes, you eat. You got I even gave the one a car wash addicts. card, and I'm like, no excuses. Here's a card for the car wash. You can get as many car washes as you want. It's still. It's yeah, still. but maybe you know, it's cooler. You know, maybe yeah. it looks cooler the dirtier yeah. it is. I don't <laughs> know. Maybe they're when just I lazy. sat there with him and washed the car, I showed him how beautiful it looks when it's clean. Uh -huh. I think he got the point. Because I mean, he had he hadn't watched it since, but still. <laughs> <laughs> and it's so funny when you uh, when people say, "Oh, this person did the same jokes," and they don't realize how long it takes to, oh, to, yeah. to create jokes. Jokes oh, take yeah. a couple years. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. And then when people come and say, "Oh, you said the same joke," but singers can sing the same old song. Yeah. Like Soul <laughs> Shop. <laughs> you know what though? I, I think that when you're funny, you're just inherently funny. I, agree. I mean, I've watched the two I of you and, and talked with you a little bit, you know, during the breaks, and you're just funny. You're just funny people. But but you're saying there there is actually an art to putting it in oh, a, in yeah. a skit. In it's a, an art yeah. form. It takes oh, yeah. a long time, and sometimes yeah. it looks like you're up there just riffing. Sometimes, but sometimes you can actually it could be a worked out joke that you've actually planned, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. yeah. But then if you repeat it, it's a catch-22. Sometimes if you don't say a joke, they go, hey, why didn't you say that one joke? Right. Or then if you say, oh, you said that joke again. You're like, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's an act. It's an act that you have. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. You go on stage and you do your act for an hour, and you go home, you know, unless you have two shows, and, and, and some of these clubs, I'm working three and four shows a night. <laughs> Act that you do, and, and you do the same act over. And everyone gets to see your act. Yeah. At uh, Addison Improv. Addison mm -hmm. Improv. Yes. yes. And right. uh, let's see, it'll be tonight through Sunday. Two yes. shows tonight, three tomorrow, and one Sunday. They got me working my God. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm an old black man. Give me a break. <laughs> but you look good in that bow tie. You get tickets at improv.com, and we'll be.